Hi, I'm Jen. I'm the owner of My Brooklyn Pilates, and with this video, we'll continue our DR series. So this one's going to be about the do's and don'ts of DR. Now that depends on the severity of D your DR. So I'm going to go with mine. Mine was severe, so I'm going to kind of give you some tips if yours is severe. Of course, as always, I recommend you go get checked out, see what's going on, but you can use this as a guide once you kind of know what's happening with you, a guide to go, okay, now what did my you know, what did my pelvic floor specialist say? What am I not supposed to do? What am I allowed to do? Um, so you can come back to my video and I can you know help you out. So one thing is abdominal rest. You want that top layer of abdominals, the linea alba, to get a break. So that includes slouchy posture. That's not gonna help your DR. So doing exercises that um, help keep your spine nice and long and straight and neutral is going to be helpful. Um, and things to avoid are crunches, sit-ups, even any kind of sitting up action. If you're reclined back in a chair, use your hands to help you sit up. Don't lean forward without using your hands. If you're lying in bed, don't sit forward. Don't sit up out of bed. Roll over on your side and push yourself up with your hands. So anything that resembles a sit up or sitting up action is um, a no-no, at least at first. What may also be contraindicated or not recommended is anything on hands and knees. So no planks, no push-ups on hands and knees, no cat-cow, Nothing that allows the belly to hang down towards the floor. So that may, depending on the severity of your DR, you may not be rec it may not be recommended to do that as well. Another one is deep twisting because that also just applies too much pressure. So those are a few types of body movements that you should um, probably um, discontinue for a little while. So what you should do are exercises that cinch in the waist and grow you taller. Like I said, work on your posture. Another thing is if you have excess belly fat is um, losing some, um, some belly fat, getting rid of that weight on the belly can actually help with the DR. Wearing a belly band of some kind, taping can help. So those are some do's if you have DR. But again, go talk to your, your pelvic floor specialist. They'll give you specifics on for you what you need to do. But this was just a, a general um, list of do's and don'ts.